Hello, this is my second Max Headroom review. I'm reviewing the second episode of 20 Minutes Into the Future, which is called Rakers. Rakers takes place shortly after the events in Blipfords. We find out that the reason Theora knows all about little boys is because she has a younger brother named Sean. Sean and his common-law wife, Winnie, have a baby, which means that Sean needs to make extra money by raking. No, not raking yards. Raking is a new sport where Freddy Krueger wannabes ride on motorized skateboards and claw each other while trying to retrieve an old remote. So naturally, Theora takes off to find her estranged brother, which does not sit well with Murray, who tells Edison she's off the show. Edison disagrees, however, and goes to look for her. He eventually finds her and learns about raking. Edison decides to find out more about the sport and soon learns the terrible nature of the game. Meanwhile, Network 23, Chevy Ed in the boardroom, that is, have been working on making raking a legal sport, not knowing how violent it is or how dangerous it is, and is even keen on setting up betting kiosks. In the end, when they find out the truth of the matter, Network 23 denounces the violent sport, and Theora and her brother are reunited. The show ends with Theora and Edison visiting Sean and Winnie, and Winnie suggesting that Theora should have a baby with Edison. Now, this is a very interesting episode, and it's quite good. But there are some parts that are a little rushed, which is understandable as it's only an hour long and has to figure in time for commercial advertisements. One of the things that bother, a couple of things that bother me are one, we don't really get to know too much about why Theora and her brother are estranged. I understand that it's because she was adopted and he wasn't, which makes me wonder why he's credited as Sean Jones when Jones was apparently her adopted name. And I don't know if this is something that she gave him afterwards, you know. But um, another thing that doesn't make sense is in the end, Winnie and uh, Sean suggest that Edison and Theora should have a baby. And by this point, as far as I know, Theora's only known Edison for maybe a week, two weeks at the most. And even by 80 standards, I think that's rushing things a little bit. I can understand that maybe Winnie's only teasing Theora, but uh, Edison seems very keen on the matter. and. Um, makes me wonder just what Edison thinks of Theora. The other characters, Murray, Bryce, and Cheviot, uh, pretty much take a backstage, um, take a, they don't really show up very much in this episode, but um, it's interesting to note that uh, Max does oddly enough ask Bryce when Bryce says that Theora Edison must be fond of Theora to go looking for her. Max asks if fond is the same as fondle to which Bryce revealing his innocence in matters such as this is I don't know. But um, I wonder why Max would ask that since he comes from Edison's mind and according to a later episode, was born at the age of 23 with no past to account for it, but even so, you would think that somebody of that intelligence would know the difference or the similarities between the two. However, on the whole, Rakers does sit as a very good episode, and it's very well put together. The acting, the dialogue, the scenes are very well done. But I think it would have been more exciting if the rake boards had moved a little bit more quickly, but still it's very well told and on a scale of 1 to 10 I would probably give it about a, a 7, maybe an 8. So that's it for this review and I'll be back in a few days with another one. 
unless I decide to do one later. I'm sorry this review is so short, but it's um it's a pretty condensed story and there's not really much to tell about it. As I said, the acting, directing and uh, the um, story itself was very well put together and it's a good uh, analogy on the subject of violence on television and movies. And the next episode I will be reviewing is called, I believe, Body Banks. and. Um, or maybe it was security systems, but it's one of the two, and I will be reviewing both of those in the near future. And until then, take care, and I will see you later.